what is going on everybody it's josh thomas here from nintendo beyond it is wednesday may 16th and uh just a day or two ago nintendo of japan updated the mario tennis aces website and i thought well, as you can see it's got to be somewhere in this video up there over there down there i don't know where i'm going to put it uh but we're just going to casually look through the website i have not looked at it yet and i thought you know i'm pretty excited i want to see what what new information is on the website and so let's make a little bonus video out of it just a nice little casual hangout checking out the Japanese website for Mario Tennis Aces for the Switch. Okay, so uh, this is the main hub page, if you will. What do we got here? I like this artwork. This is pretty good. This is some pretty uh, pretty snazzy artwork. I like that. Look at Mario's even like matching his socks with his shoes. He's got the blue socks, kind of go with the blue in his overalls and stuff. He knows Mario has got some Mario style. I want a, a Mario style savvy game now. Um, but yeah, I really do like this artwork. It's pretty good. Why is Toad so shocked over there? Look at him. Ah! He's not even looking at the ball. So what is he horrified by? I don't know. Oh, it's a tiebreaker. I see. Um, but yeah, it's nice art. I gotta say though, this is, you guys know me. I'm the king of shoe style. The shoes are a little too detailed, I feel. They're all wearing different shoes now in this game. And I feel like the shoes are a little bit disproportionately detailed compared to the actual cartooniness of their clothing. I don't know. I'm just, I'm nitpicking. Uh, it's not, a, I'm not like a, upset by it um so what do we got here they're talking about the free demo that you can play the tournament it's gonna be june 1st uh through june 3rd so i think you can play between the, like a weekend for a whole weekend you can play anytime you want that is pretty fantastic uh I, obviously some of this is gonna be in japanese so we're not gonna be able to read it what's going on here something about nintendo switch oh i clicked on okay wait hold on we're skipping all right that's the main hub page. I think all the links on that just bring you to each one of these individual sections. There are four of them in total. Uh, <laughs> I like the, I always like when Google tries to translate things for us. So we got power to hold the key to winning energy. Players can use special techniques at the energy they did. Wow. Hey, there's Spike. Oh, hold on a second. I haven't really seen him playing like this. Like I haven't, oh, Toadette's in there. Did we know that? Maybe we, we probably knew that. I don't remember seeing Toadette though. That's pretty good. Look at Spike, he's a beast. I think I like Spike. He's got a big ass racket too. That's pretty impressive, I like him. I noticed his racket has spikes on it. I'm not one of these people that's down on Spike. I think I like Spike a little bit more than the Chain Chomp. Um, yeah, look at him go, that's pretty good. There's just, I love, I really love that they have made tennis a more strategical game where you always seem to be doing something different. You know, it's not just a You know, there's a lot of like different techniques to use. And so, yeah, fantastic. Loving it. <clears throat> so this is just talking about the basics of tennis. You got your charge shot, technical shot. Let's read some of these because they're pretty funny. Technical shot. In addition to hitting a ball far away, you can greatly increase your energy. However, it is a high risk slash high return shot that runs slowly if you... This actually sort of makes sense. That was a decent translation, Google. Uh, where's my mouse? There it is. Oh, look at that. Oh, man. I'm, you know what? I am loving how far we've come with the pre-rendered artwork for Mario and Friends. You notice that? Like back in the GameCube days, it looked a little plasticky and kind of uh, <coughs> under detailed. Man, that is look Mario, you Mario, you look good, my friend. All right, what do we got here? A shot aiming everywhere in the court and a technique to catch up with a powerful smash. Dot 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 dot. Which of the various skills that can be carried out is selected at a what timing will be the victory of I don't even know what the heck that means. Um, oh, whoa, Luigi, look at you. Oh, his tennis racket is broke. Well, I, I mean, we knew that, but I look, wow, look at that. What is on the other side here? Ooh, look at Peach. Peach's, <laughs> Peach's skirt is pretty high up. Not hating it. I'm going to be honest. Oh, what is this? Oh, yeah. Let's it go. Oh, ooh, yahoo. Like this. This is cinematic here. That's nice. Ooh, look at Bowser. He's ticked. Is Bowser gonna do his? Oh, he's lighting his racket on fire. Holy crap! Look at that. That's a smooth character model. That is good. Ooh, I like this. All right. So that's talking about the deadly shot. It is exactly a deadly shot that consumes energy and activates it. Sure. All right. Play against computer opponents. Clear the mission. Improve your ability. So that's telling it. Oh, battle mode. What is that? What is battle mode? Okay. Oh, we're going to open up a few tabs here because I don't know if those are linked in the top. All right. So that's everything in this category. What was this again? This was uh, 
technique. This was talking about different techniques in this section. Okay, let's go to the next category. <coughs> I'm getting... Ladies and gentlemen, I'm getting legitimately hyped for this game. I uh, have loved Mario sports games for the longest time, and they have just been sucky to the max lately. I think the last one that was good was Mario Golf World Tour on the 3DS, but it kind of sucked in a way because it was like, I don't want to play this on my 3DS. I wanted to play that on like the Wii U. Um, so yeah, this is going to be like the first one since I think Sluggers on the Wii that I am genuinely really hyped for. So it's, it's a good feeling. All right, what do we got here? What is this category? So this category is game modes. Ooh, look at Daisy. Look at Daisy and Peach there. I'm not the biggest fan of Daisy, but sometimes the, the light catches are just right. And I'm thinking to myself, I don't know. I don't know. That's pretty good. Um, Nick is trying to call me right now at 11, 10 PM. Nick, I can't, I'm recording a video, Nick. All right. <coughs> Hopefully that didn't interrupt the, uh, interrupt the footage here. If you bring Nintendo switch and software up to four people can play. So this is just talking about, you can play, uh, like via LAN, you know, whatever they call it officially. You can play online, which is something I'll probably be doing a lot if it runs smoothly and it better run smoothly because what? Nick, Nick's trying to call me again. I'm ignoring you, Nick. I'm trying to learn about Mario Tennis Aces through a Japanese website. So these are the different ways you can play. Oh, geez. I'm, oh, look at that. That is a sweet, I love this artwork. I kind of want to try to save this. Look at Toad over there and his little, or I'm sorry, Canopio. Canopio's hot live comic raises the battle. Can that be on a t-shirt, please? Canopio's hot live comic raises the battle. I'll say. All right, you win against opponent. So this is just, oh, online tournament. Yep, we got tournaments here. What does this say? Hold on a second. Online tournament, which competes with players all over the world, is held monthly. Oh, that's pretty good. You know, they were talking about how you unlock characters and costumes and stuff. So I guess every month you'll be able to unlock stuff. I don't know, I still would just prefer to unlock stuff by completing challenges and, and uh, specific tasks in the game, you know? I don't wanna have to wait seven months to unlock everything, that's stupid. Um, but every month at a tournament, that's not bad. That's about how often they do Splatfest, it seems. Winning tournaments, we aim for the top with all three tournaments. At the beginning, you can only participate in one tournament, but by winning, you will be able to come, you will be able to challenge a tournament with a higher degree of difficulty. Got it, okay. Motion controls, I am pretty hyped about the motion controls. I gotta be honest. I think if they are really well programmed, that is gonna be my uh, my default way of playing. Why, why do this when I can like actually get into it? You know, when it's summertime, you, Drop a few pounds playing some Mario Tennis very competitively. Uh, okay, so that's everything in the uh, in the different game modes. Interestingly enough, though, they did not talk about like mini games. Like, is there a mini game mode? There better be, because like Mario Power Tennis has that really cool mini game mode where you can just take on the challenges. And we've seen the missions and oh wait a minute, that maybe that's what they're talking about with the mission mode. They mentioned something about missions down here somewhere. There's tournaments. Did they mention missions or am I just imagining things? I don't know. I'm probably imagining things. But uh, yeah, okay, let's move on. Next one. <clears throat> I'm just saying there better be a, like a mission minigame mode that I can play with four friends. Whoa, okay, hold on. Is this more footage than what they showed in the trailer? I think this is. There's no sound. But, oh, wait, wait, yeah, this is. Man, I, oh, I am so... This alone gives me plenty of confidence that this game was made with love. Camelot is ready to uh, redeem themselves. Oh man, this is reminding me of Mario Power Tennis's intro. Look at this. Oh, 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 oh. I'm hyped! Oh, wait, we got a description here. The day. Wait a minute, hold on. <clears throat> Nick, Nick is just. Now he's sending me. Now this guy is stalking me, for God's sakes. Now he's sending me Facebook messages. God. Jesus. The day of a certain tennis match, with the power of a dubious racket brought in by Wario and Waluigi, that's an interesting way of spelling his name, the hall is in panic. When Ripples creases, no, when Ripples ceases, Luigi, which was supposed to be there, cannot be found anywhere. Wario and Waluigi also disappeared all the time. What? That? I want that on a shirt as well. Wario and Waluigi also disappeared all the time. <clears throat> Sorry, <clears throat> back to my announce voice. According to Canopio, the racket brought in by Wario is a horrible racket with the ability to manipulate people. Ooh. 
If you unravel the mystery of that racket, you may find clues to Luigi that disappeared. <laughs> Mario departed for a new adventure to save Luigi. So the mission mode, the mission mode's purpose is to save Luigi? That's pretty crazy. All right. I mean, why that looks, I don't know anything about Marvel, but that looks like the tennis racket version of the Infinity Gauntlet hand thing, which is okay. A little weird. I can't wait to watch this full intro, and I hope there are. I hope there's like FMV cutscenes for a lot of stuff through the story. Oh man, I'm, I'm, that alone has got me excited. What, what is the what is the category we're in? We're in story. Okay, so what do we got here? Ooh, oh, look at these courts. Mm, okay, hold on a second. Let's take a moment. That's the only one I don't like. That looks crappy. Oddly enough, the desert one looks like it's rendered in a horrible engine. It looks all plasticky and flat. Looks like it's using outdated bump mapping. Look at that. Oh, look at that. I don't. That doesn't look very good. I'm sorry, but that one doesn't look great. That one looks fine. Although I have a rule. When it comes to design, I feel like winter and snow plus sunset don't work so well. I don't like that look. Like right there. See, it's during the sunset. I don't like that so much. Uh, I think winter with snow, it has to be day, like a cloudy day, or it has to be nighttime. I know that's weird, but that's just the way I feel, okay? So anyways, we got these. It's talking about like the different missions. I love these. These are so cool. So that has gimmicks. I imagine you can play this court with the gimmick. I want all the courts to have the gimmicks because that's the way I prefer to play. Oh my God, is that the final boss battle they're spoiling for us? Let's move on from there. All right, we got some images scrolling here. What do we got? Ooh, there's, okay, that looks like a, like a mini game in a, in a temple in the sand area. That's kind of interesting. Got some cutscenes talking to Donkey Kong. Oh, that looks like a cutscene. The one next to Donkey Kong here where Mario's walking in. See, that looks better. The sand king, the, the sand court looks way better with that lighting. I hope you can change the lighting when you play. I know that's a weird thing to want, but it looks so much better that way. PD Piranha, I love PD. Obviously, he originates from Mario Sunshine. We got that really cool. Ooh, I love those mirrors in the haunted area. Oh, what is that? Oh, look, we can see the overworld map here where you get into the haunted area. That's cool. Oh, I cannot wait. It's reminding me a little bit of Mario Super Sluggers, the, the map and like moving around from space to space. That's very reminiscent of Mario Super Sluggers. Um, what do you... Not only will the status of Mario climb up when you challenge the missions and gain experience, there are things that you can get, like a new racket. By clearing, gather a lot of rackets is also important, as it will be game over if all the rackets are destroyed. So that's neat. We saw that in the trailer, how there's like many different rackets. Uh, I'm almost out of time here, so we got to kind of pile through this. This is characters. These are all the confirmed characters. Man! Those, oh, them character renders are fantastic. All right, we got all around is Mario, Luigi, and Daisy. Daisy's all around? That's a little weird. Okay, there's Daisy. Uh, so Peach is a technical and Toadette is a technical. I kind of like Toadette. Toadette originates from Mario Kart Double Dash. All right, we got some powerful ones. Bowser, Wario, Donkey Kong. Spike is a powerful? All right. Chain Chomp, obviously he's going to be powerful. Waluigi is defensive, as is my man Bowser Jr. I might go with Bowser Jr. Rosalina, that's who Roger is going to play as. I can't wait to beat Roger. When he plays as Rosalina, I'm going to probably play as Spike or Bowser Jr. Uh, and then we got Kinopio, Toad, and Yoshi are speed. Oh, man, these are great. This is great. Uh, so, yeah, that's the, that's the Mario Tennis. Uh, that's the Mario T Tennis Aces website in Japan. It's pretty cool. Pretty spiffy website. I don't know if the English one is up. I didn't even check. Uh, I don't really follow Nintendo of America or anything. Um, but this is looking good. How many characters we got? Two, four, six... 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yes, I'm counting with my fingers. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So we got 16 confirmed, but I think there's also some like Shy Guy was in there, people saw, and Dry Bones. So that'd be 18. That'd be 18. So I don't know. Seems like there's a decent amount of characters, but I want to see even more. I want this to get up to at least 20 or 22, somewhere in there. Um, but I am hyped, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. I really want to play this game. We're going to have to do some like online tournaments if you can do them or something here at the channel. Uh, definitely going to do some episodes of The Fold. I know that. We've got about a month left to wait. It's going to be a long month, but uh, I'm ready. I'm ready for some Mario Tennis Aces.